Cycel has expanded its USG line in a somewhat strange manner. Before, the series was developed mainly for enterprise gateway purposes, serving as a security backbone for the network, but now it seems that Zyxel wants to dominate the SMB and the power user market as well. And that's how the SRC 50 axe and the newer USG Lite 60 ax came to be. I have tested the former some time ago and it was an interesting device, although a bit controversial since it relied only on a cloud platform. The USG Lite 60X follows the same philosophy and since I got one unit on my hands, I decided to open it up and see what's inside. The device sits vertically and I found no mounting holes, and to stay steady it does rely on an adjustable base. I'm not sure about its longevity, but if you go with a set and leave approach then there should be no problem. There are two screws on the bottom which we do need to remove and thankfully no warranty seals. After that, it's necessary to use a prime tool and patiently move around the case. It's going to take some time if you don't want to damage the plastic hinges. The two plastic pieces of the case should eventually detach, but be careful that the antennas are routed beneath the PCB, so we need to first take it out of the plastic case to move forward. I also detached the antennas that I could, and saw that there are two dedicated for 5GHz and two for 2.4GHz, while two other are shared between the two radio bands. I took the four screws out and could finally remove the PCB from the case. There are two heat spreaders, one at the top and one on the bottom of the board, but they are interconnected with four screws. Remove them and we should be able to detach the bottom heat spreader. I also removed the heat pads but could not find any main component here. Moving back to the top side, I removed the metallic plate and I also had to take out the aluminum covers to see the main components. I do need to mention the 4-pin console port. And these are the main components. All in all, this is an interesting device, so if you wish to know more, stay tuned for the test video which will come soon. Also, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching and see you next time.